beautiful chilly and foggy winter morning no u turn takes you with us to see the world's largest step well right here in india's abaneri district in rajasthan welcome to chand bauri a magnificent ancient structure still standing strong after almost 13 centuries bauri means well and chand was the name of the king during whose dynasty this well is known to have been constructed this well greets you almost immediately on entry and the first impression is a wow feeling it's huge both in width and depth with an ancient look and we can guarantee you it's the biggest well you've ever seen now a step well will mean that it has steps going down right till the water and you have plenty of these steps out here so while this structure is rectangular it has steps on three sides and one side has these tiered galleries going right till the water the structure is also lined by beautiful corridors on all three sides with arc design and the most beautiful part of this structure is the geometric symmetry and the precision with which these steps have been replicated and when light plays with this structure the shadows cast around give you the most cinematic or picturesque views that can ever be so what was this well actually built for now gauging from what records you find on the internet or archaeological survey of india reports there's not much to be found and the most probable utility comes out to be recreation the temperature at the bottom of the swell would be roughly 4 to 5 degrees lesser than ambient temperature making it a great place to gather around for any kind of recreation or gatherings especially in rajasthan because of its hot and arid climate and the summers which will send the mercury shooting up the structure has also stood the test of time especially during the eras where the mogul invasion of india happened during which time it is known that these structures were plundered and demolished and destroyed so these galleries which were once probably choices seating positions for the rich and famous of the time now serve as housing for the ruins which are neatly stacked for preservation Our next stop is right next to Chanbauri within 100 meters the Harsha Devi temple. Now this temple the way it stands today is nowhere as it stood centuries ago. It is also dated to more or less the same time as Chanbauri but as we stated earlier this temple has also been the victim of the numerous invasions that India has had over the years. So the archaeological survey of India has gathered the ruins whatever they could find and placed them in the most appropriate version but this is not the original format regardless of the history or the debate around the origins of this structure it stands today as a symbol of resilience and strength over almost 13 centuries we are so glad we made this trip This is no you turn a channel that brings to you a travel and lifestyle experiences. So do subscribe and stay in touch with all our latest videos and keep those messages coming in. We really love it when you write to us about our videos. Make sure you travel, explore and live. We'll see you in the next video. Take care and be safe.